Okay, and now that I have the secret setting on, let's go into here and oh my god! Yo, what's up, guys? Dadpick1 here, and after numerous requests, I will finally show you the secrets to getting high FPS in Fortnite. Even if you're playing on a potato, you'll still get a decent boost in FPS using these tricks. Alright, let's get straight into the video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and let's go! Now, this will work on any platform. What you have to do is turn off record replays. Trust me, this will make your experience a lot smoother. Next, go to the account tab and turn off show social notifications and show on career leaderboards. This will decrease lag and FPS drops if you have a huge friend list. If you're on PC or laptop, trust me, this next method will definitely lower your FPS. So first, what you have to do is go to your desktop and then go to the little search bar by the bottom and type in CMD and then press enter. Now, once you have that, you type in this one command right here, shut down slash S. Now, before you press enter, this will turn off your computer completely. So make sure you have all your work saved and stuff. So the next time you load up your computer, it will have higher FPS, trust me. Okay, next you're going to have to make a custom resolution. If you have an AMD graphics card, I'm sorry, I have no idea how to do this. Anyway, go into NVIDIA control panel and then go to manage 3D settings. Now, once you're in there, you go to program settings and then you find your Fortnite app. Once you're on there, make sure you copy all the settings that I have in here. Make sure you cap your FPS somewhere close to the refresh rate of your monitor. So if you're 60 hertz, cap it at 61, 90 hertz, 91, and so on. Next, you're going to want to make a custom resolution. Now, this is going to be slightly stretched res, but don't worry, it's not going to be too much. I just use 1600 by 1024. And all you have to do is press create custom resolution and uh, type in some settings and boom, there you go. For my last tip, this is for all the laptop players out there. What you're going to have to do is come down to your battery option and press power options. Now, once you're in this menu, press change plan settings, then go to change advanced power settings. Once you're in this menu, make sure you press the Intel graphics settings or whatever graphics settings are here and drop down the menu and make sure under plugged in it's under maximum performance trust me you're going to want to have this on all the time because if it's on balanced or maximum battery life your game will run slow then go to processor power management and make sure the minimum processor state for plugged in is a high number i recommend maybe 80 percent or 99 percent if it's really bad and for maximum processor state make sure that's 100 of course make sure your system cooling policy is active at all times because if your computer is not cooling then your fps will be stuttering a lot okay and one last tip make sure that your graphics cards and everything are up to date i use geforce so go to geforce experience and press check for updates and download the latest driver updates Trust me, you're going to want to do this because it will help your computer a lot. Okay, so in Fortnite, I get a nice and stable 301 FPS, which is my cap. And here are my settings right here. Yes, I know they're pretty garbage, but I'm pretty used to using these settings all the time. And even if I make them higher, I will still stay on my high FPS. I have DirectX 12 on, multi-threaded rendering, and all that good stuff on. And right here I have windowed full screen. Um, I would choose full screen, but my clips don't record if I have it on that. So uh, yeah, 